Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, ah, welcome to the Daily Grind. How you doing out there this morning? Good, I hope. I hope you're having a great morning. Hope you have a great day. Good coffee morning, good tea morning, good biscuit morning, whatever kind of morning you have. I hope it's a good one. <clears throat> Let's get the crack lacking. If you think other people's problems don't concern you, you don't need to be of service, help somebody out. It's their bed. They made it, let them lay in it type of thinking. I got a little story for you. Mouse was all excited. Farmers got a package. He see that. He was looking out through his hole. He see the farmer's wife come in with that package, and they were all excited, and he was all excited. He opened it up. It was a mouse trap. He was devastated. He's like, oh, my God. He ran outside to tell the rest of the farm animals the bad news. He ran up to the chicken. Mr. Chicken, Mr. Chicken, you're not going to believe what's going on. The farmers get a mouse trap. The chicken kind of chuckled, and he says, well, Mr. Mouse, I'm a chicken. Mouse trap doesn't bother me none, so I don't see that as my problem. That's your problem. And he just couldn't believe it. He ran over to the lamb, and he says, Mr. Lamb, Mr. Lamb, he says, the farmers, they got us a mouse trap. What are we going to do? The lamb laughed, and he says, well, I'm a lamb. I'm a big old lamb. Mouse trap isn't going to bother me. It's going to bother you. I'll keep you in my prayers. He ran over to the cow, and he said, Mr. Cow, Mr. Cow, the farmers got a mouse trap. What are we going to do? cow said, oh, I ain't going to do nothing. That's not my problem. It's your problem. I'm a cow. I'm not a mouse. That's for you to worry about, not me. Have a good day and run along. Well, that night, the, the farmer's wife heard the snap of that mouse trap and thought she caught the mouse. So she ran out there without turning the light on and grabbed the mouse trap. And what she had was a poisonous snake, and it just caught the tail in it better. And she screamed, and the farmer woke up, and he had to rush her to the hospital, and they rushed her to the hospital and did what they could do for her. And a couple days later, she came home, and she was very ill, very sick. And she wasn't getting better, so the farmer went out and got a butcher knife and killed a chicken and butchered it, made her some chicken soup. And she still wasn't getting better, and a lot of the neighbors were coming over and helping him take care of her because he had to run the farm, so they were sticking around the house and order to feed everybody. He butchered the lamb cut it up and cooked it so all the people that were coming over to help could feed her lo and behold she didn't make it she passed away farmer had to pay for the funeral so he butchered the cow and sold the meat paid for the funeral so you see if you don't think it's worth your time to help somebody else you could be sadly mistaken because their problem could very well be a big problem for you um, being of service is a good thing. Being of service, taking a little time to help somebody out, there's nothing wrong with that. It, it's always a good thing. And if you don't, it could come back and bite you. If you just ignore the fact that other people need help and you don't bother helping them out, what goes around comes around. As they say, if you're never helping anybody and you think everybody's problems is their own and you don't want to take 10 seconds out of your day or 10 minutes out of your day to help them out, well, next thing you know, it could be your problem and there's nobody around to help you out. Totally up to you. You can do whatever you want. I find service to be a wonderful way to live life. Uh, it's very satisfying. You can say what you want about it, but it feels good to help someone out. It feels good. It makes two hearts happy, them and you, and you don't know how that ripple affects other people. You go help one person, and you don't know how many people that person is going to help. Anyway, be of service. Help people out. It's just the right thing to do. Uh, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. I hope you have a great day, and watch out for the mice traps.